makakasama sa sit-out ni Romeo at Alapag. Itong sina Pingris and Dondon Ontiveros. Labin-anim naman lalaro nating magiting na nagre-represent para sa Pilipinas is off and running now. Jason Castro looking to open up things in an explosive way. Mas ka lang sa three-point attempt na yun. Alam mo, masusubukan dito para sa Gilas Pilipinas yung disiplina natin as a team. You know, it doesn't matter kung malakas o mahina ang kalaban mo. Kailangan you have to play the game consistently. Yung effort level niyo, yung energy niyo, dapat hindi bababa kung mas mahina yung kalaban. It has to be consistent. Uh, para pagdating ng mga tougher games ahead, eh, yan ang may expect ng coaching staff mula sa ating mga players. Salo na, Charlie. Yun niya, ano? Pangwalong laro na natin in the last eight days, eh hindi nga ganun kabata naman ang ating mga manlalaro as these kids from Chinese Taipei open up the scoring. That three-pointer was delivered by Lin Weihan. And of course, they are looking for their first win. So, you know, they're going to this game highly motivated. Dahil ayaw naman nilang matapos yung tournament. Nawala man lang silang panalo. Steal by the Taiwanese. Nice shovel pass on the run. Layup complete there by Chen Wei Ju. Ngayon, pinapakita ka nila yung young legs nila, no? Very slow coming down on defense sa ating Gilas Pilipinas to start this uh, ball game. Wala sa labas. Si Intal pupunta dito kay De Ocampo. Toss from 17 feet. Finally gets Gilas on the board. Well, mataas pa kumpiyansa nito si Sunny Toss. Remember, in the game last night against the USA, crucial yung mga mid-range jumpers na binitawan itong si Sunny Toss. Kick out pass to the long ball. Ganda naman ang shooting to open this game in Chinese Taipei B. Oh, at uh, nasutuwa yung mga kanilang kababayan uh, dito inside the arena. Dahil nga ito, six points kagad ang kanilang nilamang. Inahabol na dito. The mother of all upsets for this Jones Cup. Tandaan natin, nung huling nakita sa Chinese Taipei, ang ating national team was back in 2012. At ang inuwi natin dun, gintong medalya. That's right. Ako, ito pa. Masamang development to. Another third over at fast break opportunity para sa Chinese Taipei. And three on one. Pero mo, walang bumaba na white shirts. At, at yun yung kinakatakot natin, Char. Yung energy yung binabanggit mo. Tila kulang. Yes, at saka syempre yung, you know, tinalo nilang, uh, tinalo natin ang USA uh, kagabi. So right now, we might think this would be an easy assignment. It could be an easy assignment, pero kailangan trabawin ng gusto. Leo Campo goes to the pivot. His jump hook, hindi uubra, walo na ang abante. Itong Taipei B. At uh, kita natin, no, the sideline, mukhang may papasok ang new personnel kagad. Ito si Coach Tab. Instead of calling a timeout, titignan niya muna kung change of personnel can inject some fresh energy dito sa ating kukunan. Another three-pointer, pero hindi uubra yun dahil na stepping on the sideline na. Mo Tao Tua and Matt Ganuelos Rosser making the way onto the floor. Some young blood being inserted dito ni Coach Tap. That's correct. Oh, so Rani Del, JC Intal, and Gary David ang uh, pinakupong muna dahil hindi nga nagustuhan ni Coach Tap itong ating malamayang simula. Si Abueva yung pangatlong ipinasok dito ang naiwan na lang sa sex si Nafos and Castro. Ah, ito hindi maubusan ng energy to Siguro kahit mga preschool lang kalaban niya, <laughs> hindi pa rin niya pagbibigyan yan. <laughs> Calvin Abueva Immediately trying to make an impact. At saka kahit siguro labin limang sunod na araw na labin limang sunod na laro, <laughs> eh okay lang. Oo. Oh, oh. So ito, Calvin Abueva hagad, uh, troop to the line. Uh, maganda yung aggressive drive to the basket niya. Kaya siya na, na foul ng player ng Chinese Taipei. Pero bitin itong unang free throw ni Calvin. How much energy did it take last night para stave off yung comeback? ng USA na na-inbear na pa ito. Nakikinig ako sa inyo ni Charlie. May kamukha kasi siya ng buhok. <laughs> Oo, oh, yung, yung isa wala lang headband eh, no? Si McDonald. Pero, yun na nga, no? Dahil instead, instead of an easy cruise to an easy win, as uh, pinapakita si Terence so, Romeo, siguro namimiss na itong mga Chinese Taipei fans. Eh, napilita pa tayo to really to buckle down to work in the end game dahil nga doon sa run na ginawa ng USA. From the corner, ah, atake ng mga Taiwanese taken away by Castro. Jason looking to pump some life into our fight. Nice passing. Abueva though misses. Pero nagpadagdag lang pala ng rebound. That's right. That's si Abueva. Uh, ito na maganda na yung pag-inject nitong uh, younger uh, players. Sabi mo nga, itong si Matt Manuelas Rosa ito. Medyo tumatakbo na tayo. Nahipagtakbuhan na tayo dito sa Chinese Taipei. Abueva giving chase. Bothers that shot enough. Toss over to Castro. Gilas pushing hard down the middle. Jason Castro delivers the deuce. So it just took a couple of substitutions to change the 
uh, tempo and the uh, energy of our team. At ngayon nga, we are only down by three. Gandang discard yun on chart, no? Hindi nag-timeout para hindi magpakita ng panic. Nagpalit lang ng personnel, yes. nag-adjust lang. At ito, nakipagsabaya na tayo. Oo, oh, you can uh, emphasize your point with that quick change of personnel kaagad. No? Of course, players coming off the bench, nakikita rin nila kung ano yung nakikita ng coaching staff. At uh, kaya naman sila pinasok ay para nga mag-inject ng energy at hindi naman nila binigo ang uh, coaching staff ng Gilas. As we take another look at that beautiful drive from earlier on from Jason Castro. Kanina-kanina, nakatap out si Matt Ganuelas. Abueva now with the rebound. Castro in the front court. Jason goes up without that leather. Three on two the other way. Beautiful finish mula kay Chen Weiju. Oo, wala na naman tayo numbers doon. No? Disadvantage tayo. Uh, six points na para kay Chen. At uh, perfect from the field. Castro on the attack, bounces it to Sauce. Elbow jumper, the boss could not deliver. Tao Tua keeps it on that side of the floor. This Chinese Taipei team, they have a no dominant center. The highest, uh, tallest player nila is around 6'7. And a uh, young 6'7 at that. Saka hindi mga wide body dito mga players of Chinese Taipei. So we really can impose our uh, presence inside the paint. As long as makasabay tayo sa takuan, kayang mamain to. You know, yes, Jay. and if we take care of the basketball para hindi magbigyan ng ganitong opportunities to Chinese Taipei team na mga layups na ganyan. So, abante pa rin ng lima. Ito yung Chinese Taipei pero ang Gilas Pilipinas after that adjustment from earlier looking a little bit better. Tapos yung pinakabata sa lahat ipinasok na. Si Asitao Lava. Tau Lava and Tau Tua on the floor together. That's a menacing presence, John. That's correct. You know, it's a wide body to set screens. And of course, we're expecting a lot of rebounds from these two giants. Tau Tua with a jump hook, showing us his footwork. Nabasa tatlong inahabol ng Gilas Pilipinas. Nangalahati na po ang quarter number one. Fast, pa punta sa loob. Sinabayan ni Calvin Abueva. That's gonna be a foul on the beast. We're not as solid with our uh, ball screen defenses dito sa game na to as compared to sa game uh, last night. Kita mo, medyo late yung naging uh, weak side help dito si Calvin Abueva against the rolling center of Chinese Taipei. Timeout requested kung saan eh magbe-break na tayo. Patuloy ang ating pagtutok sa kahuli-huli ang araw ng kompetisyon dyan po sa 2015 William Jones Cup. Ang Gilas Pilipinas po, gunning for the silver. Pero so far, early in this game, pinahihirapan ng Chinese Taipei B. Yun ang nga masama dyan. No? Kasi the last thing you want to do when facing a supposedly inferior opponent is bigyan sila ng kumpiyansa sa umpisa ng ball game, no Para mapaniwala yung sarili nyo na kaya nilang talunin itong uh, ating kumpunan. So, tignan natin after this time kung paano maging adjustment itong ating Gilas Pilipinas. Tautua is with Castro, Abueva, Taulava, and Ganuelas Rosser. Castro taps it over papunta kay Tautua. Mo to Jason for the long one. That's good! Good hustle, diving for loose balls. Nakuha natin yung 50-50 ball na yun. At ngayon, dalawa na lang ang inahabol ng ating Team Pilipinas. Jason Castro-William now with a total of 5 points. Taipei B on the attack. They look to drag the defense of Asi all the way out. Nice looper of a jumper to push their lead back up to 4. At ito rin ang Chinese Taipei. No? Parang playing without pressure, very loose. You know, no hesitations of their shots. Kaya naman, mas maganda na nagiging resulta ng tira nila. Pero ito. Umiinit na rin si Jason Castro. Yeah, no, watch out though. Jason Castro-Williams starting to sizzle. Baba na sa isa ang abante netong Chinese Taipei B. First quarter na to atid sa atin ng Phoenix Petroleum. Phoenix, fuel the dream. Repasuhan natin sandali, no, chart. Itong Chinese Taipei. Binuksan ng ating laro by dropping a 7-0 bomb on Gilas. Itong ating mga manlilaro. 
seemed a bit flat, seemed a bit medyo pagod. Pinalitan ni Coach Tab yung tatlo sa lineup. Pinasok yung mga bata like Abueva, Rosser at etong si Tautua. Ito na tayo, right in back in the thick of the fight. Yun na nga, no? Pero ang, maganda, ang hindi lang maganda dito eh, itong 17 points na kagad na binibigay ng ating uh, Team Pilipinas with 3 and 45 remaining. Kagabi against uh, a much stronger USA team in such first three quarters. They did not allow them to score 20 points uh, in any of those quarters. Pero ngayon, Eh, masyado ng marami itong pinamigay natin sa Chinese Taipei. Parang mukhang nagising na ng tulo yan itong Gilas Pilipinas. We see them hustling for that leather, battling for those 50-50 balls. You know, it's always nice to remember that there's no such thing as an automatic win uh, para sa, sa ating kuponan. And you really have to work hard for it, especially right now. Sinabi nga natin, pag manalo tayo sa larong ito, eh sa atin na yung silver medal. Tautua will throw back to the bench. Excellent energy provided by that big man. Gary David, kanina nag-start, ibinalik sa sayo, kasabay pa niyang kanyang pagpasok. Sa unang pagkakataon naman, si Aldrich Ramos. David from the outside, Pintis. Pagkakataon ng Taipei B, dagdaga ng kanilang dalawang puntos na kalamangan. Magtitimon para sa kanila, si Chen Chao Yi. On the attack, it is Lee Chia Ju. Air ball, pero nando dun sa ilalim. Ito namang si Xiao Shun Yi. You can see activity level dito no, ng Chinese Taipei. Taipei, very active lahat sila, even off the ball. Kaya dun nawala yung uh, tao nito Chinese Taipei player underneath the basket. Good defense, challenge natin. Kaya nga lang, binibigyan natin sila ng mga second chance opportunities. Something you do not want to see. Sakto, tatlong minuto natitira sa ating unang yugto. And the young guns from Chinese Taipei looking to weather this gila storm. Ganda ng kanilang simula. Kaso, nahabol din gagad sila. They look to close out the first quarter by retaking control. That's right. And I'm sure they're very excited to play our Gilas Pilipinas team. Dahil nakita nga nila kung ka kaano rin kaganda yung mga nilalaro ng ating kuponan dito sa Jones Cup. At uh, marami silang patutunan. Laking bagay na na just to get to play with a team of this caliber as Calvin Abueva holsters it after knocking down that long bomb. Grabe rin yung nagawa ng tournament ito sa confidence ni Calvin Abueva. No? Hey, I'm not saying na wala siyang kumpiyansa dati. <laughs> Napakatasa ng kumpiyansa. Pero lalo na ngayon after playing in this tournament. Well documented ng kapatid natin si Carlo Pamintuan. Ano? Na tuwan-tuwa si Calvin na finally pinapalakpakan siya ngayon ng karamihan ng tao. Oo, oh, tama yan. At hindi lang buong Pilipinas kung mapalakpak na sa kanya. At ito namang big man ng Chinese Taipei. Ako si Lee ay may 4 points na. Nagpapakita ng magandang shooting mula sa labas. Rosser denied on that opportunity. Tumatak mo na naman itong mga bata. Abueva para sa board. Pero hindi na mukhang bata yung tumira na yun. <laughs> Pinakamatanda ng lineup nga na to. Hindi, kasi kita mo yung hairline. Oh. Medyo... Ano na eh? Oh, busina, busina. Ay, sorry, sorry, Puta sorry. Huwag kang may hairline. Bawal sorry, magpintuhan sorry, sorry. tungkol sa hairline. Di ba may line. bangs ka na ngayon? <laughs> bang lang bang. <laughs> busina naman. Lahat na pong dalawang minuto natitira. Sa first quarter of action. Ganuelas gets it right back from Taulava. Pupunta sa kanto kay Ramos. Long bomb doesn't drop. Maybe with a rebound. That's a difference here in the first quarter so far. It took Chinese Taipei knocking down open looks at the basket. It's a fade away, tough shot. Sobrang alang ang resulta. Abueva looks to get it across. Calvin looking to go wall to wall. Wala na. Pag binigyan na mo yung momentum si Calvin na ganyan eh. Goodbye na yun. Yun ang kinasanayan niya. Uh -huh. uh, nalaro, even it's a college days pa niya. I'm sure even before his college days. At uh, yan, kaya pino mo, nakikita mo yung ngiti dito kay Calvin ng Pueva. Meron na siyang 8 points and 3 rebounds. Pag nakabuelo na ng ganun, malamang belap na abutin mo pagkatapos. Ayan ano? oh, oh. Ay, na naman si Calvin. Pinabot nga lang sa braso sa pagkakataon na to. Oo. Oh, oh. Pero may pagkakataon siyang ibigay sa Gilles Pilipinas ang unang tikim natin ng kalamangan. Ay, medyo, itong dalawang free throw parating para sa kanya. Medyo nasaktan si Calvin doon. Nakita mo naman yung ankle breaker na ginawa ni Calvin doon sa move na yon. Kaya lang, secondary line of defense. Ayun, sumabit sa kanyang uh, braso. 
Foul whistled on Lee Tewei, the 6 7 center. Uy, masakit to pag si Calvin, ganyan katagal na, na nakahiga. Usually okay. naman sinasakripisyo niya ang katawan niya, madalas sumadsan. Pero pagka medyo tumagal na sa seg, oh, oh. delikado. Ito, mahita ulit natin ang nangyari sa kanya. Ulo, so... Hindi, baka sa likod yung oh, sakit nito eh. Balakang ba o likod? Parang inaalalayan niya. Tsaka hindi biro yan kasi nga araw-araw ang laro eh. And then uh, in, in some days, meron pa silang shoot around in the morning. So this is something you don't want to see on the last day of a tune-up tournament. Yes, yes, that's right. Okay, alam naman natin si Dabi, spilit is a stretching lang yun. Just needed to catch his breath, Charlie. Oh, pero good na, na kaya niya tumayo sa sarili niya lakas. No? At uh, I'm sure everybody there in the arena, yun, concerned rin sila dito kay Calvin Agwebo. Yun, likod niya yung tinitignan niya. Eh, pinalo ba ni Coach? <laughs> Mas masakit yan bukas pagkagising. Oo oh, nga. Of course, the Filipinos in full force supporting our Gilas Pilipinas. At mukhang yeyeluhan muna itong likod ni Calvin Abueva. Lamang pa rin ang isa dito, ang Taipei B, 21-20. Buti na lang, SPG tayo, yeah, no? Eh. <laughs> Dira, yun. Hindi layo na, hindi layo na. Uh -oh. <laughs> uh, okay. So, okay naman. Matibay naman yan si, uh, si Calvin. Mga type na type sa ng camera man. <laughs> Ayaw ialis sa kanya. Yung pagkakatutok uh, ng camera. Oh, minamasahe pa sa nila, Jason Cass. <laughs> here's, a, here's a question, though. Oo. Oh. Baka may pagkakaiba sa PBA rules, ano? Hmm. Hindi siya magpe-free throw. Oo. Ah, siya kung pwede siyang bumalik. Pwede ba siyang bumalik? Yan. Alam ko, Piba, pwede. Oo, Pero pwede hindi ko sure. Oo, pwede yan. Pwede, pwede. Sa Piba, pwede yan. Eh. Pagka sa PBA, pagka hindi ko kumuha ng free throw mo, hindi ka na pwede Oo, bumalik sa ito. Oo, tama Kasi so, baka pwedeng gawin discard eh, minsan. Eh. <laughs> Chetroy Rosario, hold off the bench, mintis, pero put back is good. Si Aldrin Ramos ba yun? Oo, Aldrin Ramos yun. So, maganda. Ito pa yung press na pinapakita ng ating team Pilipinas. No, pinakita rin yan against USA uh, sa laban kagabi. And, uh, well, we have young players on the floor also with Ganuelas Rosers, Troy Rosario. So, ang nakakabilib rin dyan, even with Asi Taolava, even with uh, Ranidel de Ocampo, eh, nagpe-press pa rin sila. And, you know, our, our, our big guys, you know, have to keep up. For the first time this afternoon, takalamang na ang Gilas Pilipinas after falling behind early. Tautua now on the floor with that rebound. Rosser, forward pass to the post. They go to Tautua. On the move, off the spin. Mo, buta tayo na bot, pero pati braso kasama. Pero ang ganda nga ng footwork itong si uh, Mo Tautua. No? Uh, he, can, he can really handle the ball, kitong up with the... Ball on the floor, tapos may spin move pa siya for a big guy, parang uh, uh, doing a move of a guard or, or a small forward. Ito si Tautua, and giving us glimpses of what he can do uh, pagkapasok uh, ng PBA season. Tautua completes that first free throw. So, naka-recover naman so far, late in this first quarter. Yes. Yung kinakatakot natin. Okay bang sa simula na nangyari yun at nagising kagad yung oh, mga naman. bata natin? Oo oh, naman, buti na sa simula kasi you have all three quarters to recover from that slow start. Uh, of, of course, you always want to get off to a, to a good start. Pero pag hindi, at least may time pa to recover. Eto na naman yung pressing defense. Kita mo naman pag-dive sa bola. Oh, pero nagawa ng paraan ah. Uh, itawid pa rin niya. Three-pointer on the way. Mintis, Rosser giving chase. Foul whistle down to Tua. How about Rosser diving into the bench? That's correct, you know. And, uh, napakaganda nga nung uh, energy na pinapakita itong lineup na to. Tsaka kahit si Tau Tua on the backcourt, dive for the loose ball. Ito na si Rosser. Ayun, tumalong pa pala yung isang uh, taga-Chinese type. Eh. Yes, oo. Oh, oh. Namaan yata si Kuya Bong. Well, you can see, you know, this is, uh, sinasabi mo nga, tune-up tournament, but look at our players, you know, die for loose balls. And 
you know, even uh, being the last game of the tournament, talagang leaving nothing to chance. Tanda natin, at stake today, pilak na medalya, a silver medal para sa Gilas Pilipinas. Napanalunan na natin ang Jones Cup ng apat na beses. Tatlong beses naman tayo naka-third place dito, pero never pang nag-silver ang Pilipinas sa Jones Cup. Should be quite an achievement. That's correct. And, uh, you know, sinasabi nga natin, it's not really about winning or losing this tournament, pero why not, if you can pick up a silver on, on the way to your preparation, why not? At eto, kita ko naman ball handling skills. Trumes pa! Motau Tua running the length of the floor pero di niya nagustuhan ang resulta dahil nagbintis nga siya pero ngayon pa man ang Gilas Pilipinas after falling behind early 7-0 naka-recover to end the first quarter up by 3 24-21